Hey guys, today's the day we are cleaning the car. Welcome back to Lime and Bean Living. If you guys are new here, my name is Emily. Welcome to my little motherhood channel where I take care of all things mom. In today's video, we are going to be deep cleaning our Suburban. It's been a long time coming and I'm super excited to have it nice and clean. Juan and Aubrey are out shopping right now, so I'm just gonna show some of the before shots and when they get back, because I've got this little guy, uh, we're gonna kind of tag team it and try to do all of the deep cleaning together. Hopefully we can get it all done today. If I were to the sea, baby, I never say for I would fall into the light. Every time I try to breathe, the moon will rise and carry me for I've loved and I. So as you guys could see, our car is in well need of a good wash and there are some stains from previous experiences in Juan's family. So we are going to be wet backing the car as well. But while we're outside waiting for Juan and Aubrey to get back, let me go ahead and show you the progress that's been made on our front yard. All right, so yesterday they were, like the workers were digging out a lot of the dirt here. Um, we're gonna have this all be cement. So we're gonna have like a third driveway spot. And they have been digging the little trenches for um, a retaining wall. And we got some nice flowering roses, which I'm excited about. The only bummer thing is that they have thorns and you know, Aubrey loves picking flowers. So I hope she just doesn't hurt her little fingers. But it will be nice to have a third parking spot just because the two that we have. Oh, you okay, dude? Yeah. The two that we have like would be too much of a squeeze to fit both of our cars. So having the third one, you know, we can kind of have a little bit of wiggle room and both park on the driveway rather than having someone park in the street. Our garage, it's like already, it's full with junk. So we're not gonna park there right now anyways, but we wouldn't even park the Suburban in there cause we have like six inches of wiggle room. So the driveway is where it's gonna be at. So we're excited to get this poured and then the cement path will continue into our backyard. And like I've been mentioning over and over, having like a figure eight, I'm so excited to have that done. And it should be done in the next couple of weeks. What did you just say? Dad, Daddy sprayed water on me and I float. You got wet.
All right, Juan, you grew up with the Suburban. Tell me your favorite memory in this car. Getting pulled over for making a legal U-turn during our last family vacation. You made the illegal U-turn? Yeah. Yeah. That's your favorite memory? Yeah. What's your least favorite memory then? <laughs> Having uh, Eddie crash it. Oh, Eddie, I know you're watching this. All the dents, all the damages, Eddie. <laughs> and in the meantime, Aubrey's making a mess with our dirt over here. Aubrey, what are you building? Yeah. We're to house it. With it. Do, 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 do. Uh, come on, walk. Okay, so Juan just finished washing the car. It is getting a little dark and these kiddos are gonna need to get to bed soon. So we are gonna call it quits. Uh, we will be cleaning, hopefully deep cleaning, the inside of the car sometime soon. Probably not tomorrow, because tomorrow is Mother's Day, but you never know. I do like me a good wet back and that might be kind of satisfying to do. So maybe that'll be like a fun Mother's Day treat at the end of our day, but I really doubt that it's gonna happen. So I will check back in and continue this video when we do go ahead and do the inside of the car, which will hopefully happen sometime this week. So it has been a number of weeks since Mother's Day. Uh, we got our cement poured and lots of stuff has happened. Our Suburban is now dirty again, but Juan is going to finally wet back the inside. So I thought I would bring you guys along and hopefully it'll be satisfying because it is awfully dirty in there. Hey, bubs. <coughs> Aubrey uh, wants to water her plants, so let's go ahead and do that first. I'm gonna leave it on for a long time. I'm a sucky. We will see if this actually comes out. And I don't know how we're gonna get that gum off, maybe with like a hair trimmer or something, but hopefully this will look like brand new in just a few minutes. I want that gum too. You want that gum? Mm -hmm. You wanna take a picture of the gum for the memory? Yeah. Okay, I'll take a picture of it. Okay, take a picture and I wanna see. Jack's in the stroller for the first time in this setting. I don't know if I will uh, use this again so soon or if I'm just going to keep using his car seat, but he seems to be doing well. Hey, bubs. Do you like the stroller? That I like that little, little hole there. I wish we could put the back of the baby toy in there again. <laughs> okay. So, uh, whose fault was this one? If you're a Wands family and you know who put the gum here,
call them out in the comments. You're right. It's already looking a whole lot better though. Can I touch it? No, not Why? yet. Because there's a lot of chemicals in the carpet right now. When it's nice and clean and vacuumed out, you can touch it, okay? But this water right here, oh my gosh, it's like a latte. It's like coffee with foam on top. It's disgusting. Okay, so that is still going on, but it is getting late and I got to wash this little boy up. So I will go ahead and show you guys the final results of the trunk. And eventually Juan is going to be doing like the inside of the car and I'll show you guys that as well. But I'd like to thank you guys for watching this like odd vlog. <laughs> and I hope you found some satisfaction in watching our car get cleaned at different points. If you liked it, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If not, give it a thumbs down. I don't care. And if you guys are new here, we would love for you to stick around and subscribe and we'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye. Woohoo! You've made it to the end of the video. If you didn't know already, every Monday and Friday, you can find motherhood and lifestyle content on this channel. And since us moms have to do it all, that may mean yummy recipes, easy DIYs, mom hacks, cleaning and organization, or just a combo of everything. Please know that you are loved and you are made for greatness, and I will catch you in the next one.